Okay, I'm going to make another video. And instead of using the spark gap, which is right there, we're going to use this HID bulb instead of the spark gap. So, anyways, what we're going to do is the same thing. We're going to run it with the generator, pulsing it through the relays caps it's about 13 and 316 uf 400 volt caps very x set on 90 volts voltage doubler then going through this coil and using about 15 diodes actually now about 18 diodes in parallel and running this HID bulb. Anyways, let's fire it up. So right now it is firing this HID bulb. Flip it around. If I turn down the voltage, you can see the arc, maybe. Taking a long time to drop the voltage in the caps. Speed it up a little. There we go. There we go. Okay. Pick up the voltage. Slowly. Slowly. That's about a normal spark gap. And then this is just starting out to get higher and obviously it'll go up from there camera probably can't see it but anyways it's very bright I don't know if you can just see it off the wall or something I'll speed it up Let's just say it's very bright. Camera gets all funny messed up. Mm. Screen going crazy. Can I take all this nasty plasma light? Must be not good for the eyes either. So, yeah, let's flip this thing around. Yeah, but you can see maybe the spark could be tense to the label. Mm. Maybe. The spark there. You can see the plasma, 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 plasma. Oh, I got a good idea. Maybe I'll use some sunglasses for this. But anyways, that's it. That's all the fun we're having. That's the way the cookie crumbles. <laughs>